Okay, we're back at it with the pink bar. We're gonna do this test and we're gonna push down on this thing and then it's gonna pull apart on this part. Underneath here, we just have this steel ball on the aluminum. We've got this rubber spacer and then underneath the ball will sit inside of the washer, which I added and it won't slip in this direction because I've put the nut. I haven't run this test yet and I'm worried the steel might bend. So the washer will help spread out the force and so that the ball doesn't just Whoop. This distance is 10 centimeters and this distance is 40 centimeters. And so however much I push down here, it's going to be pushing up three times that um, on my green joint. Okay, here it goes. Oh, it's tilting. Okay, okay. Stay centered. Oh, yeah. It's almost my full weight. <laughs> that is too cool so at least according to my calculations this was 600 pounds of tension um, and it was a double test test of the top and bottom sides the part is called sleeve version one posted on grabcad all i did was use super glue and 3 8 inch pink bar this is the fiberglass rebar that's only about five or ten dollars for an eight foot stick and then You'll liberally add the super glue here on these faces, bond in one half, and then mate it and bond with the other half so that it uh, closes up neatly. If you go to cut this material, then the fiberglass will chew up most steel blades, and so carbide is a good choice. I used this grit-based carbide blade on my jigsaw, and it cuts through very quickly and without too much dust. This is the first kind that I got. And now I've went to the hardware store and they just have the green ones. And so I liked pink better, but whatever. There's really nothing special about this print or its settings. It's ABS plastic and it has 30% infill, but I just use default settings. I'm, I'm working on testing geometries and mating, not so much uh, something special about 3D printing. So this is your starting point to make up any other kind of joint. Just adjust the geometry for whatever you need to attach it to. And good luck out there.